Curtain went up on Xavier's first season in the Big East as Chris Mack led his guys into their exhibition opener at the Sintas today. Only preseason tune-up for the Musketeers, so they need to take full advantage before tipping off a reel on Friday night. Division II Quincy University treated to an early dose of Xavier threes. Here's Miles Davis pumps this one in from the wing. Three of his 15 points. He hit three from long range. Later in the first, Justin Martin coming down the wing. He's going to miss, but take a look at the big fella. Matt Stainbrook cleaning up. Follows strong as he goes to the reverse. 14 points, nine rebounds for Matt. This time, Martin has it on the opposite wing. This time, he's not missing that one. Little floater off the window. X ready to put it away now. Samaje Kristen. The steal. He's going to pipe this one down on the other end. 12 points, seven assists for Samaje. X wins 84 54. They'll open the season 7 o'clock Friday at home against Gardner Webb. How about the Bearcats in action as well today? Mick Cronin's guys playing their second and final exhibition game at fifth third. Bearcats looking to the post. Justin Jackson gets too deep to be dealt with. He had 19 points on eight of 10 shooting. Bearcats running now. Sean Kilpatrick, easiest of his two 24 points of the night. Shot it well too, seven of 10 from the floor. Here's Jackson working the post again. Gets the seal. A little double clutch off the window. UC starts to pull away now. Shaq Thomas leading the break. Slips a little past to Jeremiah Davis the third. He's got two. 84-72 UC beats Bellarmine by 12. They'll do it for real Friday, November 8th against North Carolina Central. Tip off at 8 p.m. At 20-0 since taking over in Columbus, Urban Meyer was still a win shy of his all-time personal best. The Buckeyes head coach once led the Florida Gators to 21 straight wins. That was his goal today with fourth-ranked Ohio State visiting West Lafayette to take on Purdue. First quarter looked like Urban. Would get that 21st win game and in Durant relatively easy fashion. Duran Grant going to step in front of this pass from Danny Etling and oh, he's gone. 33 yards. Duran's going to take this all the way back. Nice move to bounce outside. OSU in the lead, 7 0. Same spread later in the first. Braxton Miller, the fake. And he's got Jeff Hireman wide open at the 20 for a 40 yard touchdown. 100 yards receiving for Hireman. First tight end to do that in Columbus since 98. 49 nothing now. Miller out into the flat for Ezekiel Elliott. Nice move by Elliott. Touchdown, Buckeyes. 56 zip the final. Urban Meyer now 21 0. High school game over the river with Connor visiting Covcat. Covcat leading 20 0. Connor finally going to get on the board with Andrew Way. Going to bounce this outside, take it in. Point after failed though. 20 6 game at that point. Connor back on the move now. Quarterback Drew Barker. Gonna keep this one. He's going to cough this one up, though. Covcats Austin Oberhausen. There to recover. Covcat going to turn that into points. Ben Dressman rolls. Finds Evan Brown for six more. 27 6. Covcat leading. 40 6. The final. Colonels and Blue to 8 2 this season. Different kind of football. Second ranked Mason Boys soccer team in action today against Lakota East. 55th minute scoreless match. Jack Clark dribbling in and fires a lefty strike for the first goal of the match. 1 0 Mason on top. 61st minute now, still one zip. Lakota throwing in. It's headed away by Mason, but comes right to Christian Lytle, and he just has to guide this thing through for the tying score. But Mason would answer late for a 2 1 win. Good day for Mason. The boys will join the girls in the state final four, while the girls cross country team won the state championship today. And the individual state cross-country champ is Ursula, St. Ursula Jr., Annie Heffernan, while the boys of St. X won their fifth straight cross-country title.